How's it going guys and welcome back to a brand new video. EA just dropped a flashback guaranteed SBC. For cheap, fast and reliable FIFA 20 Ultimate Team coins, check out u7buy.com and use code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. This pack guarantees you a flashback player. Uh, and it's only an 84 rated squad for 60 chem. It's not too bad. Uh, I guess we'll sort of see how they are. We'll open my, myself and a bunch of viewers packs um, and see how they are. Let me know in the comments down below who you guys get. Make sure you subscribe if you're not subbed already and leave a like on the video. Here we go with my guaranteed flashback player. What are we getting, EA? Is it going to be someone good? That is the question. It's going to be a flashback. Wow. Uh, it's going to be German. Center back. Boateng. That's good. Hey, I'll take that. Uh, very, very good card. I don't already have him in the club, so that is actually fantastic. Um, I don't remember exactly how much he was to complete, but it was definitely more than an 84 rated squad. That is a, a really, really good one. Uh, so we'll take that. That could have been S fine. That's all I'm saying. That is, uh, that is one of the best ones you can get. Still incredibly usable at this stage of the game, in my opinion. Um, so yeah, decent. Let's go and open some viewer packs. All right, next flashback player. This is Joe's flashback player. Let's see what we're getting. His, his club name is Balotelli, Tobies. Let's get him Balotelli. That would be quite funny, I think. Here we go. Are we getting something as good as I just got? I like the, uh, I like the flair. It's quite cool. It's going to be Argentina. I have no idea who this is. Benega? No, Mascherano. Benega didn't even have one, does he? Mascherano. Um... Not great, sadly. Not the worst looking card, just uh, sadly not fantastic. Bit of an L, unfortunately. Now it's time for Buster's pack. Let's see what we get him in the flashback player pack. Come on. I want to see at least one Mertens. That'll be pretty cool. Um, you know, Modric should be decent as well. Uh, be interested to see if we get the non-premium versions of them or the premium versions as well. That'll be interesting. It's going to be Brazilian. Oh, Eden Militao. No, it's Miranda. Damn it. Oh, I mean, honestly, that's a really good card still. Um, I actually find it really difficult to play against him in the weekend league. He's actually a really good card still uh, and has some great stats. I just got so trolled. So trolled right then. I really thought that was Ed Emeritao. Um, That's still not too bad, though. Next one. These are, these are, they're doing, oh, God, what have I done here? Well, I've, uh, I've, I've asked for help, apparently. These aren't doing too badly here. Um... We've had some decent players so far. Uh, so I guess we sort of see if that kind of look continues. Hopefully it does. We'll see. Next one is going to be Brazilian again. RA. I don't know who this is. Ooh, is that Rafael? Not great. Not actually that bad of a right back. Probably still usable even at the stage of the game. But you will need like a shadow or an anchor on him to improve his pace just a little bit. Uh, could have been better. Not fantastic. EA, flashback Coleman, please. That's what we're hoping for here. A flashback Seamus Coleman would genuinely be perfect for this team. He's got normal Coleman in the team. Come on. Flashback Coleman, please. Imagine. Oh, it's French. Cam. Who is this? Valbuena. Uh, it's not too bad. Again, another card that I think is still usable at this stage of the game. Uh, it's sadly not one of the big dogs, but it's not terrible, to be fair. It's not that bad. He's already got 90 Militao and the 96 Modric. So that's not what we're looking for here. We're looking for anyone but those guys. He has a red 98 Neymar as well, which is pretty impressive. Here we go. What are we getting from this one, EA? It's going to be Brazilian. <sighs> I mean, you know, there was only two players in the entirety of the, the like 45 available that we asked to not get. And then you go and get them. If you didn't already have him, that's incredible. But he already has him. Reese's pack up next. We've done pretty well so far. Like, I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm quite happy with the look that we've had so far. I just hope that we can get that look for the people that need those players. As opposed to the people that have already got them. Does that make sense? Uh, this is going to be Brazilian again. Centre forward. Hulk. I don't know why I thought Firmino. I thought that Firmino was, uh, was a flashback for a second. Actually, not that bad. Like, he's bad, but it's not bad at the same time. I know it's a clunky card, okay? Um, he's probably going to turn like a, like a bus in game, all right? But he, he's actually not that bad. Like, it's not terrible. It's usable, in my opinion. Next one. Come on. What are we getting in this one? Hopefully, it's good. Fingers crossed. Uh, we've had an NAM Letal so far, so that's not been too bad. Uh, I want to see a Mertens. That would be nice. Um, this one is going to be Irish. HB. Is that... That's Coleman! I mean, it's like three accounts too late, but it's Seamus Coleman. It's actually still, in my opinion, a pretty good right-back card. Probably still pretty usable, in my opinion. Another one. 
What are we getting here? Are we getting something decent? That is the question. He submitted uh, Player Moment Sane into this SBC. So he's got faith that it could be good. Go on, Mertens. Oh, is that Vidal? No, it's Alexis Sanchez. Oh, so trolled. I forgot Alexis got one. Uh, to be honest, it's like, it's actually, I mean, it's it's not great, is it? Sadly. Um, I thought that was going to be Vidal. What are his in-games looking like? I don't actually remember this card coming out, so I don't remember what the in-games look like. Uh, what's he got? He's four-star skills, three-star weak foot, high, high. 93 agility, 94 balance, 84 finishing, 85 composure. That's actually not bad. Honestly, like, that's not that's not horrendous. Um, link him up with that new Ebra or something. Um, I'm sure you'll probably find some use for him. His pace needs upgrading, though. He'll, he'll need probably a hunter card on him or something like that. Another one. We have Eder Melitao to beat in terms of value, I think. I think Boateng to beat in terms of rating. Uh, so let's see what this one's going to be. Go on. It's going to be... Oh, Christian. Okay. Um... This guy at centre-back is actually really good. Uh, I don't think he's fantastic for a left-back. Um, and I don't think at this stage of the game, especially as a left-back. But, you know, if you play him at centre-back in game, he's actually quite hard to get past. Another one. Here we go. What are we getting here? Really good record, actually, here as well. Really good record. Um, so let's see if he's going to be rewarded or not. There's a lot of conspiracy theories around that. Here we go. This one is going to be... Nuri Sahin. Um, that is probably one of the worst ones you can get in terms of usability, in my opinion. I don't know. Like, not great, sadly. Not, like, probably not one of the worst ones, but he's definitely up there with one of the worst ones you can get, in my opinion, in terms of usability. Um, he still would fit into some teams, but it wouldn't fit into this guy's team, unfortunately, so that is now. Next one. Here we go. Come on. 1.6 million coins in the bank as well. This is good. He might be able to build a squad around him. What are we saying? We yet to see one Mertens yet. Mertens and, and Modric are the ones we haven't seen yet so far in terms of the big boys. Uh, this one is going to be Brazilian again. Centre mid. Oh, is that Paulinho? That's actually pretty good. This card is still really usable in my opinion. Actually plays really well in game. You just need a pace upgrade on him, unfortunately. Um, but no, that's, that's, that's good. That's actually good. Club name and badge on point. You deserve a reward just for having that club name and badge. Absolutely. Here we go. I don't think there is... There is X by United flashbacks available, but there's not a Man United current flashback available, I don't think. Like, that place we made... Oh. Oh. Troll. But I tell you what, still, uh, one of the best ones you can get. That is a fantastic card in game. Um, wow. Oh, yeah, I forgot Ma Juan Mata. Yeah, my bad. Juan Mata is available right now. Um, wow. That's... Uh, that's that's quite the troll, but a still fantastic player. All right, he wants Rooney. He's already got Eden Militao trapped and Boateng, so either of those is not welcome. Wayne Rooney, however, is. So let's see. Let's see. No. Oh, okay, that's actually not bad. Perfectly into Boateng. Um, so that's actually not too bad. This guy is actually good in game as well. The first loss of my weekend this weekend was because Neuer had an absolute masterclass. So that's pretty decent. That helps a lot. We'll take it. Yet another one. Here we go. Are we getting a dub or an L? That is a question. Hopefully it's someone good. We've had one Belgian so far. It was Witzel. I was hoping it'd be Mertens, but it wasn't. It was a bit of a troll. Uh, here we go. It's going to be Irish again. McGeady this time. Chain long. I forgot what his stats are looking like. What do they look like? 89 pace, 87 dribbling. As a super sub, probably not too bad. Uh, probably not too shabby, to be fair. Um... Yeah, that's all right. You know, like, it's better than some of the ones it could have been because that actually could be usable on the pitch. It's kind of meh, you know, kind of meh. Next one. Kibo's pack. Can we get him something good? Hopefully we can. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Go on. What are we getting here? Belgian or Croatian? Belgian striker. Martens! Finally, we got one. Go on, be the premium. It's the premium as well. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. What a dub. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Finally. Please do not be duplicate. Please do not be a duplicate. Yes, it's not a duplicate as well. That's incredible, man. This card looks so, so good. That's really good. Let's go. All right, next one. TTV Gamer Lads Pack. Go on. Be a good one here. 
be a good one. Mertens, honestly, you can't top Mertens. That's the best one you can get. But if we can continue getting players on that level, that's fantastic. Uh, here we go. Next one's going to be French. Right wing. Is that Biabiani? It is, isn't it? 99 pace. Oh, gosh. All right, next one. We're on a... I'd say we're not really on a roll, are we? we, we the last one we got was Biabiani. I wouldn't say we're on a roll. But uh, I would say that we could maybe recover that roll. This one's going to be Brazilian. We're on to... Uh, it's Hulk again. Uh, like I said last time, it's okay. It's not It's not terrible. I think it is still usable as a striker. I just got to know how to use clunky plays in the game. And I think that's quite a hard thing to learn. But, uh, you know. Next one. Uh, last one was Hulk. Let's get Brazilian again. But this one be a centre-back and this one be Edo Militao. That'd be pretty cool. Um, let's go. What are we saying? This one is going to be Argentinian. Oh, it's another Maserado. That's a massive L. No, that's a terrible game. Another one. Next one. What are you saying, EA? Are we getting a good one here? Come on. What are we getting from this one? This one's going to be... No way. Oh, it's Witzel again. Still, though. Still good. Um... I just wish that was another Mertens. That would have been sick. But these do seem like they're giving out majority half-decent players, um, which is always fun. I like that. I like that EA a lot. Next one. Are we going to get something good from this one uh, and continue the good run? Here we go. Uh, we are getting. I, I wonder if there's any nations we've not seen yet. We've not seen English yet. Italian. We've not seen Italian yet either. Is that Ogboda? That's good. Ogboda's really good. Premier League, Italian, uh, good centre-back as well. That's a win. We'll take that. You'd love to see that. I think a flashback Raphael here would actually work really well. He's got a headline of Neymar on 8 cam at cam. If we get that strong link to him, that would be perfect to the 4 triple 2 uh, So Raphael wouldn't be too bad. But any, obviously anyone good will be great as well. It's going to be German. Boateng? Ooh, Neuer. Um, again, good good card, good keeper. Uh, he literally is the only reason why I'm 8-1 as opposed to 8-0 this weekend. Uh, so yeah, but no, decent. Prime icon and a flashback. To end off the video, make it 25 flashbacks done. Um, let's see what the prime icon is going to be and also the flashback player. So we start off with the prime icon pack. Probably should have done the flashback first, but we'll do the prime icon first. I think this is the 10th one for Rubus. So we'll see what this is going to be. It's going to be English. Gary Lineker, of course. Of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. Um, now for the flashback. Are we ending it on a Mertens? That's the question. We'll also be opening a bunch more on Twitch. So if you guys are, are watching this point in the video um, and you're not following me on Twitch or you're not watching on Twitch, please come and get involved in the conversation and, and watching the packs on Twitch. Link in the description to that. Um, I stream every single day and we're ending off on a piss check. Not a good ending, sadly. Not a good one to end it off on. But if you have enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you later.